Hello everyone, I am Aggie, and I am here to run Dust and Lizzie and Tail any percent what for you today. Oh. And I would like to introduce my wonderful commentator, Catlick. Пошел Даст. Правда, жалко ранних без вебки. Так, время прохождения. Давайте делать ставки, господа. Ну ладно, давайте. Отдадим кому-нибудь пузырики. Разыгрываю 200 пузырьков, господа. Если сделать правильную ставку. Вообще, блин, как бы немножечко так проявим неуважение, потому что вот раннер на сноутборде хотя бы виртуальную аватарочку сделал. Sure. Uh, rocket jumping is essentially doing a certain combo and then canceling out of it with a jump slash, which gives a lot more momentum moving forward. The walk speed in this game is pretty slow in comparison. Uh, but this is very interesting. We do a combo, but on the last hit, we hit the jump. And at the same time, we cancel the last hit and hit the jump. And at the same time, we go straight into the jump. Something called the skip. Now, because of the specific uh, combo you're seeing, Dust doesn't lose very much height whatsoever, and combine that with slashing into the room transition, and you basically skip a uh, cut uh, a cutscene, which leads into a forced fight, and skipping that saves about 10 seconds. Удары в Дасте особо не позволяют персонажу падать, поэтому ранее вот так вот между экранами попрыгал и тем самым скипнул катсцену. Также тут весьма интересное передвижение бэкдэшем, как в Symphony of the Night, правда, без щита. Basically near infinite stamina. So okay, we got some zigzags going on here. We're going to collect those wall chickens and later on we're going to need items called teleport stones, which are vital for the run. So Aggie's trying to take as little damage as possible because if you do take damage uh, and you're not full health, the game will automatically use items. Uh, and obviously we don't want to do that. And we also need to make sure we have enough money for the item shop which is coming up. Ранек старается получать как можно меньше урона, потому что если у игрока не полное здоровье, то начинают автоматически использоваться предметы. Very 
Но вообще, насколько я знаю, Даст сделан всего одним человеком. Это весьма похвально. Ну да, весьма технично ранее идет. вот пришли в деревню, это главный хаб в этой игре. Здесь есть прикол с магазином, что мы можем получить вещи за гораздо меньшую цену, чем предполагается разработчикам. Сейчас ранее в локации, место в локации, где он, по идее, не должен быть, потому что у него нет специального апгрейда. Ну, раз это такая метроидование, то многие вещи, они недоступны до определенного момента игры. Но с помощью обуза передвижения Раннер смог добраться туда, куда ему сейчас не надо, и получить раньше вещь, которую ему, сейчас... которую ему надо будет по прохождению. Хорошо, пофлексил, прям камбух хаушу набил. Basically, 
Dark Bone, you just saw. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's... Mm, nice. Very and nice. we're going to do that once more. Yeah. To One more head time into for our the first... top. Yes. <laughs> we're going to head right into our first boss fight of the game. Known yeah. as Lady Pethys. I'll go ahead and explain if you'd like. Yes. That'd sure. be great. Awesome. So we basically start by doing an AI manip to get her to move where we want her to, and then we begin to crouch slag or zigzag as they call it. Uh, we need to do uh, need to stop at around 15 attacks, otherwise she will break out. Битва с этим боссом довольно простая. Мы подходим к месту, чтобы босс к нам подошел на точку, которую нам надо. И вот так вот кинцелом анимации атаки мы вот прям очень быстро ее атакуем. And that is another cutscene skip, very similar to the one earlier. Instead, we're just kind of moving back into the previous room as we en as we enter the loading zone. Uh, so right now is a good time for a couple of donations. If you have any, oh, we have a lot. You have had a lot of love come in for this, including twenty dollars from Sand Shark. Who says, let's go, Aggie. So happy to see you run this gem of a game at GDQ. Keep up the incredible work. Thank you. And we had $25 from Monev that says, I played Dust and Elysian Tail back when it launched on PC. I loved the smooth movement and combat combos. I'm super happy to see people speed running it at 2023, especially at AGDQ. Thank you so much. Прилетают донаты в поддержку этой игры. Говорят, что Dust офигенная игра. Кто там прилетел донат на 25 долларов, говорят, что играл на запуске этой игры на релизе. Очень нравится прям плавные анимации, боевая система, вообще кайф игра. Let's try again. Yeah, one more time. That that enemy was being mean. <laughs> being a bully. Yeah. That's okay. You took care of him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're going to be heading to a super spooky place. Spooky mansion. Super spooky mansion. That will be a very scary place. Oh no! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And since we're so good at mind re reading minds, we're going to you know. There's one person who who wants to get some heirlooms back, so we go, so we're going to ransack ransack a few mansions for her. You know, you know, you know, they, these these people these people aren't using using these heirlooms, right? No, 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 no. They haven't even cleaned up the place. So surely they wouldn't mind. Yeah, they wouldn't even notice them go missing. Exactly. If anything, we're helping them out by cleaning the place. <laughs> yeah, and so this chapter has a lot of very satisfying movement, a lot of slide boosts, a lot, a lot of aerial dust storms. Oh, uh, sorry. Yeah, it's one of my favorite areas of the game for city runs. It's because of how much precise movement there is. А вот такая манипуляция с картой идет, если попасть центром вслепую по точке, на которую можно телепортироваться, можно ее на нее телепортироваться заранее. To have to get it, and so we just got the ability called climb, which also is well, that one we can skip entirely. So that's we're going to do something called jump warping. So, what normally would happen is the game would warp you to the bottom corner of whichever screen you're warping to. In some specific rooms, if you do that, you'll just be in the void indefinitely. So that so that one, for example, you need height. Otherwise, you know, drifting in the void is not fun. Yeah, no. 
Yeah, even uh, doing any sort of warping can lead to getting stuck in some places, which is obviously not ideal, but... Yep. Ну вообще вот это вот э, прикол с варпами вещь нестабильная. Можно застрять где-нибудь, оказаться в пустоте или вообще игра крашнуться может. Так что сейчас э, раннер по лезвию уходит, скажем так. This last mansion is a little bit special. Yeah. And that we have to do a little bit of you know yeah. we have to do a little bit of house cleaning for them. A little bit. Yeah. You know, there's this there's this power in front. If we try to exit without with without blowing it up for us or getting rid of it, we can't leave ever. Yeah, you're just stuck It's in there. <laughs> yeah. You're not leaving. You stole too much stuff. Get out of here. Oh, wait, no. Stay in here. <laughs> stay in. You're now in jail. Yep. <laughs> mm. uh, let's see, please. Uh, вот эта озвучка у Белочки? Я, я, я вообще не думал, что это Белочка. Yeah, so That's this game That yeah, particular screen really is really leave. nasty. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, good. Yeah. yeah. So when there's enemies right near the right near the edge of Хотя, the screen. Хотя честно, фанаты Fury столько yeah, различных cool. видов создают, Russian, что right. можно как бы yeah, отдельную энциклопедию создавать. Sorry, you need you need to kill the enemies that are, that are here. Yeah. It's a bit of a pain, but eh, we make do. <laughs> And now we have all four of the items we need. We're, go we're going to talk to the. We're going to talk to this particular uh, fellow. And you know, it's fine. You got it. Ah, uh, come on. You got There it. There we go. There it is. All right. So we're gonna be doing a. Ну вообще да, любители фури плюс чат. Yeah, spooky scary skeletons. So what Aggie's gonna be doing here is a lot of zigzags, a lot of going back and forth. And if you see the swing, a swing of the arm, Aggie's gonna pause on the right moment, so that way the swing effectively does no damage. And that's basically the boss fight. You just keep doing that over and over and over again. The swing, unfortunately, is a little bit of an inconvenience, but Ой-ой-ой, не повезло, конечно. Мы тут меняем сложность, чтобы... Гемы сразу же не уходили в характеристики. И тут э, снежная локация yeah, есть there's, как there's раз. Под снежное настроение, да. I guess it's fair that they get their money back. Yeah, I guess so, even though we have negative money. <laughs> mm. Yeah. I, I guess they'll have to go somewhere else for their money. I guess so. All right. Oh. Oh. So we're going to do another uh, cutscene skip, but this time with Gihan. So... And 
interesting thing with when you talk to NPCs for the first time is all of them will give you experience. Oh, I didn't even I didn't get it. Вот тут мы еще okay. делаем скип катсцены. Uh, so, NPC, но у ранее сейчас не получилось, к сожалению, это сделать. Yes, please. Thank you. Это ранее не, недостаточно сильно прокачался. Это сейчас, сейчас будет небольшой гринд. Um, so we specifically talk to that NPC so he can level up. And now we're up to the final boss. Yes. So this boss we. Oh, это уже финальный босс, ребят. So essentially, we want to slam him down. He goes there, and we keep doing that over and over and over again until the boss fight is over. However, тактика с ним в том, что мы вставляем его в таком танлоке, манипулируя вот его передвижением, когда он вот прыгает в воздухе. То есть он примерно на этом же месте оказывается, мы вот подлавливаем все время. Exactly. It's like oh, I gotta, I gotta let you look good. Here you go. <laughs> mm -hmm. And no, it's like, you're doing it. And Excellent. yeah. And since we mentioned the word parry, it's like parry. That's parry. What's a parry? <laughs> oh, oh. Almost there. There we go. Come on. Oh. Oop. Oh. That's okay. Ah. So. One interesting fact: um, poison just does one damage per second, no matter what. It doesn't great. scale at all. One, 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 one damage, 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 damage. Ah, uh, so time <laughs> is about to come up. It's when ah uh, wait. Yeah, it's when the screen turns to white after. Когда же, когда же время? Мне кажется, да, Ранер выбрал не тот сейф файл. Ранер чуть-чуть облажался. Да, ну да, да, как бы... Явно тут сговор с некоторыми, кто ставит пузырики, да, там. Кто-то позвонил и сказал, слушай, как бы я тут поставил все пузырики в русские, подсоби, пожалуйста, как бы. Ну и ран такой. Да, пожалуйста. And we've got fifty dollars from Atreus, who says good luck on the run, Aggie. Thanks for running one of my most favorite games. Massive hype for AGDQ 2023. Thank you, everyone, for everything. Thank you both for those donations. And we've got two hundred and fifty dollars from Devin Mack, who says Dust was a life changing game for everyone involved with its creation 11 years ago. I'm overjoyed to see it here, and kudos to everyone at AGDQ. For your amazing work. Thank you so much for the $250 donation. It's awesome. Awesome. Thank you so much, everybody. Yes, thank you very much. So one thing that you might notice is this boss music is incredibly serene. Almost too much. Too so. serene. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> well. This music isn't the final boss music whatsoever. For anyone who's played this game before, you might recognize this music as the map select music. Oh, it's because of the glitch save, isn't it? <laughs> yes. Music is very, very The final boss music is very, very different to this. And this time, Gaius is... Yeah, doing pretty okay. I thought this boss fight was just supposed to be a peaceful one or something. Yeah, I thought so too. 
Yeah. One other fun thing is, since we've skipped the first three phases of this fight, the enemies that are Actually, meant to spawn yeah, in the first phases are still here. Just... Interesting, if you start playing better, if you're in a place where there's a music that's really loud. Interesting, if you start playing better, if you're in a place where there's a music that's really loud. Interesting, if you start playing better, if you're in a place where there's a music that's really loud. Interesting, if you start playing better, if you're in a place where there's a music that's really loud. Interesting, if you start playing better, if you're in a place where there's a music that's really loud. With those enemies and kills them. So random. Sometimes you'll see random drops just on the floor. That's from those enemies specifically. Sweet ghost drops. <laughs> I love those. I love them. <laughs> There we go. All right. Let's try not to pick the wrong save this time. I believe in you. It will be that that save. That save. Normal save will be. Все нормально, нормально. Все время. Talk about dust in general. Uh, so, if anyone anyone wants to learn the run, learn more about the run, there is a Discord server on the speedrun.com page. It's a really good time, and I would absolutely love it if more people wanted to pick up the game. Yeah. Поздравляем тех, кто выиграл пузырики. Я снова потерял двести. It's such a cool game, and like I said, you should check out the Discord. Join the community. It just seems like such a wholesome group of people. But also, go give Aggie love. We love to give Aggie love. Thank you very much.